Hello, Martin Baker here from Baker's Garden Buildings. I'm over in Hampshire. I wanted to show you this project that I'm really excited to show you around. A real collaboration with the client here. We've worked with them on this and uh, the end result is really, really stunning. And I've got, I've got to say some unique touches that the client's brought in, which uh, we may well be adopt, mo adopting moving forwards. Uh, building itself is six by three meters, got the inline slide indoors, and it's got that three meter by three meter canopy. At the moment, it's got like a temporary hot tub there, a full hard tub will be coming in the future. Um, fully plumbed in this building, the client has done a lot of that work. Some of the ground works uh, was also done by him, some clearance. Uh, so let me show you around the outside before we go internally. V200 MTX cladding um, throughout, that nice dark gray in the canopy as well. Uh, white ceilings and uh, the aluminium inline sliding doors. I'll show you them open in a moment. And all of them have got the integrated blinds. From the outside, you can just see up here, this kind of little, little set up there, which is the, the blinds. If you can get that just about probably there. Okay, so um, what we've then got is a door into the side here. So this is a, quite a popular option when we're doing hot tubs, is to bring a door into the side element uh, to gain access. Uh, that works really nicely. And then let me take you inside this absolutely beautifully furnished building here. Um, as I come in, you can see really considered in the colours. Uh, that three metre deep works really nice with an L-shaped sofa. I really advise that. Um, that's a really good uh, way of utilising the space inside. Climate control up there, so it's a really nice uh, cool room in the summer. It also does do some heating in the winter as well. And uniquely, no radiator in here at all, no convector heater like we normally do. That's actually an infrared panel heater that sets on the ceiling. Um, and it, that means you've gained all of the space that you want on the wall. So there's no uh, requirement to have that on, or, or, you know, a, a convector heater on the wall. Now, we've never used these. This is a bit of a, 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 a bit of a test run here, but our first accounts are working really, really well. Uh, lovely bar there built by us, uh, color match seats. You can see there's a lovely, glittery top here this is the 7016 with the with the sparkle in that the, the silver sparkle uh, round the corner in here you can see we end up with a little fridge and then all the shelving in there as well so it's lovely uh, really lovely done i really really like uh, seeing the room with a bar in of course um the wall wash lighting you can see runs around the bar there and also up along the back of the building um, and then in this corner here, we've got a 1.2 by 1.7 um, toilet and basin. Again, clients fitted for the first time an all-in-one toilet and basins. That's all integrated. It's a really cool option. So I love that. Um, towel rail here that's electrically heated um, to keep the towels warm, ready to go for the hot tub. Um, and obviously that makes this building completely self-contained, which I think is a lovely, lovely option. The um, integrated blinds I mentioned on all of the windows and the doors. Um, you've got this little slider here. I've shown you this before. Uh, you may have seen these before, a little sliding mechanism that uh, allows you to open and shut the windows. And uh, this is them in the up position. And they work well with the slider, so we've got, got them set up well. So you've got, the, um, you've got the switch there on this one here, and then on the inside. So as the door's open, that just stops perfectly to allow you to still instruct the uh, glass where to go, and the blinds where to go. As I open them doors out and then pop back outside again, sure you agree it's just a lovely room so the customer done the painting himself he done some of the electrics and nearly all of the plumbing himself as well um wanted to do that lovely antico floor got fitted oh, i think it's a candine floor my apologies a candine floor fitted and then these are the touches that the clients brought into him set for himself um and enjoyed that ownership of the building and we love doing that so some of these unique features we say we will be taking forwards um yeah, so there you go what a, what a lovely room uh, that is um over in hampshire that's to say six by three meter with a three meter canopy um, entertainment room with that lovely bar and the hot tub area um, under the 2.5 planning rules this is done within permitted development um, really working with the client here to make sure it's the perfect answer for him and they're both saying they use this room daily and they're really really enjoying it um, thank you for watching this video uh, please keep up to date with our socials and uh, like subscribe and share thank you